What's up everybody and welcome back to Flare Reviews. Tonight I have for the review of one of my all time favorite films. And that film is The Silence of the Lambs. It came out in 1991 as a thriller horror. It's gonna run you a real tight hour and 58 minutes. It is directed by Jonathan Demme. Now this movie collected all kinds of awards in 91. We got Best Actor, Best Actress, Best Picture, Best Director, and Best Writing. This movie is awesome. It is starring, as you know, Jodie Foster in the absolutely brilliant Sir Anthony Hopkins as Hannibal Lecter. So as we know from, from just in general, Jodie Foster's character is a FBI agent profiler and her job is to basically get information out of a Hannibal Lecter about the whereabouts of Buffalo Bill who is a serial killer who is kidnapping and killing girls across the U.S. So are having trouble tracking them down and basically her and Hannibal Lecter have conversations, they get to know each other, she gives him information about herself, he gives her information about himself and the way he, why he does what he did and you know is the whole you have the whole like the <laughs> his liver smelled of fava beans what tasted like fava beans with a nice Chianti I mean just like the creepy just like that opening scene where he just the camera pans over and it's just him like it's just oh it's so creepy and just oh the whole movie is just freaking awesome um, and you have Ted, Ted Levin played Buffalo Bill you have the whole creepy scene where he's like dancing around. He's like, oh, yeah, if I were me, I would totally, you know what, me. And just like, he's dressing like a girl. And it's just like, it's so, just the whole movie itself is creepy, but it's amazing at the same time. And, you know, with the ending we got with him, like Anthony Hopkins breaking out, that violent scene with him cutting the guy open and putting on the dead dude's the dead dude's face and then escaping the ambulance and then calling Clarice and then forget can't forget that famous line hello Clarice like just there's so many just great things about this film that I love you guys can tell I'm very energized by this movie I love this movie maybe that makes me weird or creepy I don't know this movie's just freaking awesome um, I watch it a couple times a year usually right around fall which I just watched a couple weeks ago I'll probably watch it again here in a couple weeks because one of my best friends hasn't seen it yet so we're gonna get him to watch for the first time but again movie is amazing through and through you guys have seen it i can't say enough great things about this film so that being said i've rambled long enough i'm going to give it a 9.5 out of 10 so my all-time favorite movies I'm gonna give it a high score it's a great flick if you haven't seen it you should be watching this and if you have or it's been a while do yourself a service and go rewatch this film again I will talk to you here next time at Flare Reviews when we review Stripes.